Hey, what's up my grandkids? It's your grandpa Hebiber here, and I got some life lessons to share with you. I know you youngsters are into Jordan Peterson, so I read his book to get some new knowledge to pass down to you. Listen here, young blood. I'm going to tell you a story about lobsters. Ain't nothing fancy, just your everyday hard-shell critters scraping by on the ocean floor. See, just like us, they're all about finding a good spot to call home. But here's the hitch. There's a whole lot of lobsters down there. What happens when two of them want the same piece of turf? Well, they ain't going to share nice, I'll tell you that. You might not believe it, but these lobsters, they're all about status, rank, and territory. It's a dog-eat-dog -dog world down there. When two of them clash, the winner takes all, and the loser, well, let's just say it ain't good to be a loser in lobster town. The thing that really gets me is what happens to a lobster after it loses a fight. Even if it was the toughest, meanest lobster before, it just gives up. Won't even take on a weaker opponent. It's like it loses its will to fight, you know? And that's not all. The lobster's noggin gets all messed up after a loss, and if by some miracle it gets back in the ring, odds are it's going to lose again. Eventually, the poor thing just gives up, keeps low, and tries not to get noticed. Now, we ain't that different, you and I, from these lobsters. When we get knocked down, we hunch over, look at our feet, and let life kick us around. It's a hard world, and it's real easy to just roll over and let it stomp on you. Why stick your neck out if you're just going to get smacked down again, you might say. And you'd have a point. But here's the kicker, kid. Standing tall ain't just about your posture. It's about your spirit. It's about taking life by the horns and saying, I'm here and I'm ready to fight. It's about accepting the weight of the world and carrying it like a champ. When you start doing that, people notice. They respect you. Good things start happening. And they feel even better. Because you earned them. So kid, you gotta decide. You gonna be a bottom dweller? Or you gonna stand tall, face life head on, and make something of yourself? And embrace the burden of being.